Okay, monitor your parents for thought crime, says Michelle Obama. Monitor your parents for thought crime, says Michelle Obama. First Lady Michelle Obama is encouraging students to monitor their older relatives, friends, and co-workers for any racially insensitive comments they might make and to challenge those comments whenever they're made. The First Lady spoke on Friday to graduating high school students in Kirka, Kansas, and in remarks released over the weekend. Obama said students need to police family and friends because federal laws can only go so far in stopping racism. Can you say fascism? This is crazy. And then what's going on over in Baltimore right now, too? Um, racial, racially motivated protests, they say it is, but really it's rioting. I think these rioters are probably paid by the government or something. Who knows who they're paid by? And uh, to incite violence just so they can bring in a martial law one day. Anyway. This is crazy what's going on here. Just continue. Oh, more laws may no longer separate us based on our skin color, but nothing in the Constitution says we have to eat together in a lunchroom or live together in the same neighborhoods, she said. There's no court case against believing in stereotypes or thinking that certain kinds of hateful jokes or comments are funny. Oh, if only we could control what other people think and feel. But until that magic day arrives, all we can do is set people against each other based on race under the guise of fighting racism. Yeah. I wonder if this extent toward hateful jokes or comments about white people or is that simply considered social justice? After all, those who believe have got it coming for possessing the same skin tone as other people who've said and done bad things. See, and now there's more racism against white people nowadays, it seems like. They don't forget, people, that white people are the minority on the planet. Think about it. Look at the populations of the whole planet. Who's the minority? Okay? We've been propagating this lie of um, white racism the last 200 years. We're only focusing on the last 200 years of history when there's way more history going on in the world than just 200 years. Um, check out this small clip of how dumbed down our society is nowadays and why they seem to think it's uh, normal for stuff like this to happen. I, I recorded this in the past, so the sound quality might not be the greatest, but check it out. This is from the latest Blue Bloods show. Make sure you the latest Blue Bloods show. I'm telling you what Oh, really? So anyway, this I, I felt that that was related to this article as like obviously they're they're changing the political views of the whole country and the North America nowadays, Canada and the USA. And this is what's happening. It's becoming socialism because they infiltrated the schools and that's what's going on. God bless. Jesus is Lord.